More than a million people, including their families, have come to the UK on foreign student visas since January 2021. Not everyone goes home when their visa expires, including Danabal from India. Was it always your intention that you wouldn't actually be a student? It was just a way of getting a visa? Uh, this is the only reason for that. I just want to save my life. But you didn't but ever plan to be a student? No, no. Determined to get to the UK and stay, Danabal says his politics got him into trouble with the Indian police. So he paid an agency there £7,000 to arrange a university place in Britain. He ended up on a course in the north of England, but says he only stayed a month. I, I just uh, thought that uh, okay, this is the only way I can get through, but I didn't know about other options. So that's why I just uh, used this. We've met Danabal in Sheffield, but he moves around the country, his life undocumented, relying on cash-in-hand jobs to survive because his student visa has expired. I'm doing garden cleaning today. Garden cleaning? Yeah. And do they pay you? No, they didn't pay me. They left this class today. This is another visa overstayer, Suresh, also from India. He says he's been given clothes for doing someone's garden in London. He says he didn't even start his course in Wales. He spent seven years just existing like this since his student visa ran out. I don't want to continue studies. I don't want to go to college. So that's why actually I tried many, many countries, not only UK. So suddenly I got visa from UK. So that's why I came. The body which represents universities in the UK says targets set by the government for course completion and enrolment by international students are currently being met. Most students who finish their studies go home, but it's been three years since the last data was released on those who overstay their visas. In the year to March 2020, thousands of students were among the 83,000 people who came on work, student, tourist and family visas with no record of leaving Britain. We asked the Home Office for more up-to-date figures, but they said none are available, which means we have no way of knowing exactly how many people came to the UK over the last three years on these kinds of visas and failed to leave the country when their visa expired. But in East London, an insight into the scale of visa overstayers from those being asked for help. It is a significant problem at this moment. Immigration solicitor Vasuki Murahathas says calls are up 50% over the past 12 months. And she has a damning indictment of the mechanisms in place to find and send overstayers back. The immigration system is um, really collapsed. Um, they are not keeping up to date. Some people, they are coming um, knowingly that uh, they can overstay and no one can do anything. The Home Office has warned those who overstay they have no right to remain and says they should be in no doubt of the government's determination to remove them. Lisa Holland, Sky News.